Finding a comfortable place, just close your eyes. Begin to connect with your center. So find your center at this moment. And the center of your being is just where you are right now. It is where you are in every breath, in every physical sensation. It's being connected to your energy and allowing thoughts to flow in and out as they naturally do without identifying with any of them. It's allowing whatever emotions might come up to come up like waves, not attaching or creating a story around any particular sensation, but just being in this time and space and knowing there is only this now moment. So in just a few moments, we will call in the violet flame energy. Um, for now, I am going to connect with you energetically and start sending you Reiki energy. So we will use both of these healing tools during, during our meditation. Just continue to breathe in this centered space. And just observing what it's like for you right now without any judgment. If there's anything coming up in your mind, in your emotions, observe it. Being completely authentic with where you are right now. And I'm sending you Reiki energy now to protect you and your space during this session so that everything that comes up is it's embraced in a protective healing light, knowing that you are very safe to be open and vulnerable with yourself. and feeling your own security, your own safety, when you allow yourself to be right here in this moment. So we're calling in now a bright iridescent light coming down from the heavens throughout your entire physical body, grounding all the way down to the floor beneath you, all the way down to the core of the earth. Creating the optimal space for you to heal, for you to integrate, for us to move any energy that needs to be moved at this moment. This white light penetrates your mind, your emotions. running through, coursing through every single cell, your entire being, and expanding out to your energetic body, to your astral body, expanding out in six feet, surrounding you in every single direction. feeling your own energy take up this amount of space around you. And 
we call in the violet flame now. The violet flame is simply a tool for alchemy. It was discovered by Saint Germain. So we call in the presence of Saint Germain now and any other guides or angels who can help in the process of alchemy, who can help aid in this violet flame transmutation process. What the violet flame does, whenever you call it in, is it transmutes one energy to another energy. So we all know that energy cannot be destroyed. It simply changes form. When we have energy that we created within our minds and our bodies, within our emotions or our energy field, we have any energy that we created that is causing a disturbance. We can call in this violet flame and it will transmute this energy into energy of love, of joy, of limitless abundance, whatever you choose. And all you have to do is call it in. It works on your behalf. This is a tool that you can use anytime, even outside of meditation. So to call it in, just visualize a purple colored flame surrounding your heart. It's not hot. What it does is burn up any lower vibrational energy, any resistance, any stuck energy. It burns it up and it alchemizes it into energy that is fluid and infinite, into the energy that resonates with your true self. So visualize this violet flame surrounding your heart. And if there is anything within your heart space that you would like to alchemize now, simply set that intention. Any resistance, any pain, all stuck energy that might be known or unknown to you at this time. We call it in to the violet flame, which acts as a magnet, just drawing it all in. It's like a sponge, just soaking it all up. And then instantly transmuting it into infinite, divine, unconditional love. And all you have to do during this process is allow, so it works 100% on your behalf the moment that you set the intention to call it in. And so we expand this violet flame now throughout your entire spinal column, throughout all of your seven main chakra power, power centers in your body. All energy known and unknown to you that you have been holding on to within you, we are asking that the violet flame transmutes these into divine infinite potential. It's pulling in any fear and transmuting it into trust and faith. It's pulling in all doubt and transmuting that into presence and love. It's pulling in any energy of lack, any energy of victimhood and transmuting those 
into infinite power as a creator. It's pulling in any indecision or lack of clarity and transmuting it to clear intuitions. It's pulling in any feeling of unworthiness, of not deserving, any resistance to giving and receiving love. And it is transmuting all of that energy into pure divine love, a feeling of oneness and a feeling of connection. And so we expand this violet flame even further. So now it engulfs your entire physical body and expands six feet out in every single direction. So your entire being, your energy field, your mental body, your emotional body is within the safety and divinity of this violet flame. And from this space, we draw in, the violet flame draws in any limiting beliefs, karmas, stuck energy from any point in time that you are still carrying with you in your energetic field. Soaks these up and it alchemizes them to pure love and light. Washing through your belief system. Every belief that stems from lack is being alchemized now. There are limitless, infinite possibilities All energy of lack is transmuted into pure potentiality. And if there's anything in particular in your life that you would like to alchemize, to turn from one energy into another, set that intention now. You can visualize it being drawn into this violet flame. And then you choose what you want this energy turned into. Just to take a few moments to allow this process now. So all resistance that you have ever experienced to infinite love, peace, grace, joy, bliss, and abundance, every single piece of resistance is all alchemized now and it is transmuted into limitless pathways. So it's as if you just have pathways, 360 all around your body, all around your being that are leading to you, that are bringing in all of this infinite energy. It has always been available to you, but we tend to build up barriers and blocks. So all of those have now been dissolved and transformed 
into these pathways. So just take a few moments to feel this infinite energy coming to you in every single area of your being. You are filling yourself up now. You are filling your cup up now, maybe for the first time in your entire life. You are allowing not only your needs to be met, but for them to be abundantly overflowed. So fill yourself, be completely filled up with all the love, all the abundance, all the joy and the bliss, all of your desires beyond what you have even imagined yet. All of this energy is coming to you. It is filling you up. And once you are full, allow this beautiful infinite energy to expand out to others. You're able to give it out freely because you have overwhelming, overflowing amounts of it. So you take what you need, you take your fill without any restrictions, without any limitations. And then you expand it out to others so that others can experience this infinite abundance, infinite love. Sending it to Mother Earth. Sending it to everyone else on this planet with the intention that we may all be able to experience the infinite potentiality that we are. There is no such thing as lack when you are divine. And we ask now that anytime we call on this violet flame, that it instantly transmutes anything that feels stuck into this infinite divine energy once again. And we take a few moments now to just share gratitude, express gratitude for this process, for Saint Germain and the guides and angels and our helpers. Gratitude for who we are as part of the divine. And gratitude for anything else that you want to show gratitude for in this moment. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And so when you're ready, beginning to feel yourself grounded Finding your center once again. Allowing all of this energy to integrate back into your being, into your body. Once again, becoming that observer. Deepening your breath. And just energetically kind of wiping off your energy, wiping mine off. I'm going to disconnect from the Reiki part of this. So be it, and so it is. 
we once again give thanks and gratitude.